that another story? Very well. There is a tale about a woodsman. He asked the trees of the forest for a branch to make a handle for his axe. Instead, the trees gave him a young sapling so they could keep their limbs. The woodsman made his axe, and then he returned and chopped down the oldest trees in the forest. Hmm. Just because trees are old doesn't mean they're smart. You there! Have you destroyed this? The statue stands no longer, spirit. Then my bond to this realm is severed. And I am off to find the real god of thunder. He will know retribution. My deepest gratitude. Off he goes. Brave guy. Want to look for Thor on his own. He is a fool. What did the spirit leave us? An offering to one of the gods. Can we use it? No, but perhaps the dwarves can. Come, boy. Now when you're done gawking, I got a favor to ask. What is it, Dwarf? There's this alchemist on Vari. Been working out in the Vellander mines. Haven't heard from him in maybe, I don't know, a hundred winters or so. Probably dead, but uh, maybe you can find him. He's dwarfing like me. Wears a fancy green ring. Owes me a favor. You look? If it is on our path. Oh, I see how it is. Not a something for nothing type, are you? Fine. If you find Donvari, I'll make him whip you up something special. This entry stone here ought to get you inside those mines. Let's do it. 
The Verlander Mines is right through these doors. Might as well have a look-see inside. What else? Sure, that's a load off your mind. Looks good. Always a pleasure. Now fuck right along. Read it. Uh, these runes read death inside. Hey, bro, you found something interesting. Did you now? Well, color me interested. So, Brock said his friend was dwarven like him. Wearing a green ring. If you wish, I will be gathering resources for our journey. You don't want to help him? No. Why not? Because I do not run errands for dwarves. Oh. Dwarven, but no ring. One of his crew? Scorch marks. There, along the floor and wall. Weird. I guess we keep looking. We. I mean. I'll keep looking. That's a soul leader. If that kills us, that's it. No Valhalla, no hell, no afterlife, ever. It does not attack. Ah. Oh. Mom made them sound more dangerous than that. Then do not drop your guard. Come. Oh, <laughs> 
Nice shot. We're gonna find Brock's friend alive, are we? Attached to the Soul Eater. Well, we know what happened to Invari now. We can just go tell Brock. No need to fight it, right? No, we will fight it. But why? Because you are frightened of it.
That was good. Right? You must learn efficiency, boy. to kill something made of rock. Be strong, Atreus. Stay focused and look for a weak point. Yes, sir. Father, let's see. Green ring, dwarvish inscription. The alchemist. But where's the rest of him? Ashes, most likely. Soul Eater got him. I guess we should bring this back to Brock. What does it say? Yes, sir.
These runes were written fast. It spells out. Ejim Staney. Hmm. I don't know that one. We will ask the blue one. So now you're interested? We found his alchemist. A reward was promised. What'd you find? Your alchemist. I'm sorry, Brock. The hand is all we could find. Still wearing the ring. There was a soul eater inside. And well, it must have burned away the rest of him. Suppose you'll still be wanting some compensation, huh? Naturally. Naturally, he says. Miani for Uxie. Take a closer look at this here ring. Maybe Anvari left a bit of magic inside for he croaked. Dwarves can do that? Sure, dwarves and magic jewels is like flies and pig lips. Supple ones. Ugh. I'm not as interested as I thought. Later then.
Hey, Brock, could you take a look at this? What you got for old Brock?